Hi everyone, it's Jeannie again, and I am back with a layout share, and then I have some hauls for you from Hobby Lobby, I placed an order with Lawn Fawn, and then I found some good stuff at the Dollar Tree, so I, and this is shopping over a period of time, but I wanted to start out with my layout. Um, my daughter and I are both nurses, and during the, she's a surgical nurse, and during the height of the um, shelter at home COVID lockdown, they weren't doing elective surgeries, so um, they were asking the surgery staff to help out in the ICU with the COVID patients, um, primarily repositioning them. They were It was good for them to be prone or on their bellies um, for a while to help with secretions and things like that. So, um, so she, my daughter ended up, you know, she volunteered to do that, and, um, and so she sent me, when she was all suited up to be helping out in the ICU, she sent me this picture, and um, you guys, I have to tell you, as a nurse, I was so, I'm always, I'm proud of her, but I was so, so proud of her for, you know, for volunteering and jumping in and helping with that as her mother. It scared me to death, and I, she sent me this picture, and I burst into tears when she, when I opened my phone. So, anyway, so I wanted to document it, and so this was the layout that I came up with, and the photo was very, um, there's, we have like laminate wood floors in our hospital, and it's kind of a yellowy type of picture, so, but it was challenging you guys to do, to have embellishments for this layout, because, you know, you don't want things that say, best day ever, <laughs> or happy this or you know all the, the stuff that that usually um, our you know our layouts or our embellishments say so I had to get really creative with the embell embellishments and I had to make some of my own so I ended up using a combination of an old for the record page kit um, from Echo Park and then I used some Dear Lizzie documentary and so the Dear Lizzie papers for documentary are um, the wood grain, this um, days of the week paper, and then this um, yellow heart paper. And then from um, documentary is this blue paper, the, all the stickers that you see, these stickers, um, this journaling card, not today COVID, um, and this, this yellow paper, and then this floral paper. And I didn't even really want to put floor, flowers on this layout, but I felt like I needed something that had all the colors in it. To kind of tie it all together so so that's what I did um, and I had this this chipboard um, arrow was just in one of my in my color embellishment drawers so I pulled that out and then these stickers that I did find that I thought were okay sentiments said a time to remember and 100% quality and then um, recorded and of course I wrote out not today COVID and then I made this little um, mask and I just folded folded paper and and used some um, crochet thread to make the little handles and then I also use um, this is a I want to say precious moments that's not right um, it's a my favorite things um, stamp oh I can't think of the name of it but anyway it's the little nurse and so I went ahead and made her if you can see her to um, match my daughter so and then I this this is a stamp I stay actually stamped on my land I don't do that very often but this is a Heidi swap stamp um, that said that you could put together kind of piece together um, my girl is special and I thought the font looked really good with the same font that's on the paper so that is my um, my COVID layout so um, and I, I really like the way it turned out even though the color palette's not something I would would normally use but um, anyway, and so, so proud of this girl. So, all right, um, let's move on then to Hobby Lobby. Um, you guys, I have good news and bad news. Um, we had a Hobby Lobby open in our town and um, just a few weeks ago, which I'm so super excited about. But on the flip side of that, our um, Tuesday morning is one of the ones that, that closed. And it's actually not in the same town where I live. It was about, it's about 40, 35, 40 minutes from where I live, but it's one of the ones that closed. So I gained a Hobby Lobby, but I lost a Tuesday morning. So that's kind of a bummer. But anyway, and you guys, I have no idea if any of this stuff is new. It may not be, If it may be really old hat if you guys have um, Hobby Lobbies in your area and you have for a long time. But, but I went ahead and all the, Paper Studio stuff was 50% off. So I just picked up a few things. I was a little overwhelmed when I went in there, um, but I got these cute balloons. 
And then these really cute um, shell with a pearl stickers, which I thought were pretty. Um, I also got um, these gems. They're a couple of different gems. These are some iridescent kind of beachy colored gems and they come in all kinds of colors but I went ahead and got those and then I thought these were pretty too and these are kind of like a faceted sparkly silver so and then I also um, picked up some of their teeny teeny tiny little paper flowers looks like they have a little wooden bead in the center of these ones super cute um, I got the yellow and pink ones too and the teeny tiny you can see how tiny they are in comparison to my thumbnail and then I picked up these ones too that had a little pearl in the middle. So, and then I got a few charms. Um, I picked up these little um, bumblebee charms, super pretty. I got these little, um, I hope you can see those and the glare's not too bad, but they're little mermaid tails. And then I also got these um, unicorns, super cute. And then um, I also picked up, these are um, also adhesive gems They're that are in strips, but they're just a kind of a clear iridescent. And I've been into hologram and iridescent lately, so I went ahead and got those. And then I just, their papers were all four for a dollar, and these are just the text weight papers. But I picked up, um, since I had a kind of a unicorn thing going, picked up the unicorn, this pretty, um, watercolor. I had a couple of those and, and I think these are all from the same line. These first ones on top that are um, the unicorns. Got that one. This one. This pretty one. So and then this one. And the rainbows. I think I got just eight sheets. And then I got um, I thought this was really pretty. This um, black heart paper so um, and they had this in other colors but I just got it in black and white because um, I love anything in black and white so I picked those up then on to Lawn Fawn I um, placed an order at Lawn Fawn and I was really happy with what I got and actually you guys I placed the order um, because they came out their newest release they came out with a dragon and those of you who have been with me for a long time you know that I collect dragon and mermaid stamps and so when I saw this little one I had to have it so um, I went on to their site because I had gotten an email that they all their stuff was in and they were actually having a special and I'll show you that in a minute but I went ahead and got the um, and this one's called what is this one called little dragon and I got the lawn cuts or the die cut or the dies for it too and then if you spent sixty dollars you got this for free and I really liked it because it's you know sending hugs but it talks about virtual and distance and long distance so it kinda is really timely for our social distancing so I really liked that so that was a um, the free gift with purchase and then I love their little stamps and I love to make little cards so I went ahead and picked up some of the other ones that I hadn't I'd seen in past releases but um, had never picked up so I got the dinosaur and the the um, dies. I got this one. Um, my husband's a, um electronic tech technician and um, I had this is an old one I think but um, I actually his birthday is tomorrow so I think I'm gonna make him a card out of this today. Um, so I thought that one was cute and then oh my gosh I love this one. This is Tiny Halloween and it has teeny tiny little dies that go like with that tiny spider and those eyes and all of that and I think um, this go this does pair with something that they have that's interactive because it says turn here to spook but um, anyway I don't know I don't have that but I thought those were that little ghost and everything were super cute super cute sentiments I also got Tiny Christmas because I've been wanting this one too and again that one also has the little turny tag there and then the lawn cuts to get that and then I also got the um, Man, um, your manatee rific. I love manatees and um, I hadn't picked these up before and I, these aren't new but I went ahead and got those and the lawn cuts for those and then um, they always throw in lots of freebies. Oh and I'm missing something. Let me see if it's still, excuse me, see if it's still in the bag. Yes. So they, they um, threw in this little um, love stamp with a with a colon on it. They also threw in, or had everything was tied up with this 
really nice um, trim it trim and this is really nice trim I've never had any of their trim before but it's super nice and it's in the colors of their packaging and then they also threw in these these three um, six by six papers super cute so thank you Lon Fawn very nice little haul there some cute stuff and then you guys will move into Dollar Tree. Um, I know there's been lots of Dollar Tree videos out there, and they've really been stepping up their game with the um, with the craft products. So I did um, find um, a couple of the eye, the sparkly eyelash trim. I, they, all they had were these two colors. I know there's there's several colors out there which I'd like to get a little bit more, but these were the only two that my store had. They had a lot of the just the regular yarn, but I didn't get any of that because. I mean, I like to make pom-poms sometimes, but I don't really use a lot of just regular yarn. But um, but anyway, so I picked these up. I thought that was cute. Then I also, they actually have a lot of glass beads now. And I, I'm also a cross-stitcher. I mean, these are great for um, for shaker cards, but I'm also a cross-stitcher. And I, I, I hate to make French knots. So I like to replace them sometimes with beads. And I don't have a very big, like, seed bead collection. So I went ahead and picked up... Um, all the different colors of beads that they had. So they had this kind of purpley one, this one in kind of the browns and neutrals, these um, seed beads in different uh, colors of pink. Here's some pretty blues and some white, gray, and black. And then this pretty green. And then they also had these glass pearls. And um, these are the off-white ones. They also had them in white. And I did buy those a time before this haul and I don't know where I I put them away so I didn't have them but but they're nice and heavy and um, they seem like they're decent quality so I got those as well then I did go kind of crazy you guys on ribbon which is weird because I haven't been using a lot of ribbon lately but um, and I have a ton of it so I really didn't need any of this but oh it's super cute and it's a box so I went ahead and got it so I got a couple of the sheer ribbons here I do love sheer ribbon and let's see these are the satins so I got a white and a black in the satin ribbon. And then they had, a re had lots of really cute um, unicorn and, um, and rainbow ribbon. And look at that. It's just like the paper that I bought, pretty much. And then this pretty um, kind of watercolor, this unicorn, this um, blue with a silver unicorn. And then this is just um, stars that are in a rainbow. So I got those. And then I got a couple of these. These are like um, lace trims, and one in purple and one in blue. Those are the only colors that they had. So I picked those up. And they also had, um, I found, I did find some of the Heidi Swap goodies. They didn't have very many or a very big variety, but they did have these two washi tapes in gold and black. And, it's kind of a gold di diagonal stripe and a black and white polka dot. And then, oh, sorry, above the camera. And then they had it in the wider rolls, too. So I got one of each and these are the love marquee they didn't I didn't see any of the letters or the um, there um, but that was okay I wasn't really in the market for those either and then anyway and then I they did have um, some of the Heidi Swap um, these are the um, kind of plastic stickers and so I went ahead they had two left and so I went ahead and got both of those I have a lot of Heidi Swap stuff that this will go with so I got that but I also picked up these craft clamps I thought those could come in handy for different, um, you know, holding things on while their glue is drying or whatever. So I got that, and then I also got um, one of these adhesive cork sheets because I thought it might be fun to die cut some stuff out of cork. So, so that's it, you guys. That's my pretty big haul over the course of the last. I have really haven't been doing very much shopping um, with quarantine and everything, but um, and the pandemic. But um, but I have ventured out to a couple of stores over the course of the last two or three weeks. So anyway, I hope that's, I hope you all are doing well. And, um, I like with everything that's going on in our world. I just like to think about the golden rule. We would just want to treat everyone like we would want to be treated. So keep that in mind as you're out there in the world. And, um, I hope you're having a great day. Bye.